Hello everyone, I'm Judy, a dermatologist from National Changgong University Hospital, Tainan, Taiwan. And I'm here to share our study about Hydradenitis separativa, or HS. HS patients have recurrent painful nodules, abscess, genifestura on the armpits, groin, and buttocks since young adults. But the pathogenesis is not very clear. Our study demonstrates IL-17 is the key pathway in HS. Skin sample from our HS patient reveal a strong expression of IL-17A. And we want to know what kind of cell expression IL-17A. To our surprise, those cells are not T cells. Based on their morphology, we suspect they are likely to be macrophage or mast cells. After several studies, we confirmed IL-17A positive cells are mast cells by the mast cell markers, such as triptase and CD117. We also find that IL-17A positive mast cells closely contact keratinocytes, which have IL-17 receptor A. But what is the function of IL-17A for keratinocytes in HS? We find that IO-17A not only can stimulate keratinocyte proliferation, but also induce HS pathogenic gene expression. Most importantly, IO-17A plus mast cell density is correlated to the severity of HS. Treatment with biologic targeting TNF-alpha and IO-17 reduces the severity of HS and the number of IO-17A plus mast cells. Here is the take-home message. IO-17A is abundant in HS, major expression in the mast cells, and correlate to the severity of HS. After biological use, the number of IO-17A mast cells are decreased. In the future, finding drug targeting IO-17A positive mast cells may let HS patients have a better life. Thank you.